I have a feeling that we're not supposed to be here, are we? But I got a shrine, so... Just want to cover that out of the way. Yeah, the, this takes us right into that maze. In the sky. Alright. Gravity and velocity. Okay, so we're gonna have to manipulate gravity. Oh my god. Huh. Is that how this works? Yo, do we... You don't mean to think we're gonna get like a... an Ultra Hand power that manipulates gravity, right? Oh wait, I think I need to go there. Oh, that is so cool. I feel like we're gonna get that sort of power so that we can control gravity. <laughs> Stupid thing is that we can't even turn. All right. <laughs> we got it this time. I said we... Okay, we got it this time. Yup. There we go. Yeah, that, I think that gravity thing is a little bit too much. I would think so. Oh, and now I have to use this one here to get to the other side. Alright, cool. You? Oh, did I need to use that ball? Oh. Oh, okay, I see. Okay. There we go. <laughs> I just had to wait for it to come. I did. God damn it. <laughs> just trying to chuckle. Just trying to chuckle. Whoops. <laughs> Didn't mean to scratch the mic. Um, I did actually look something up that somehow it's actually confirmed in this game. And I had to go somewhere to figure out if it's true. That, um, it was, I think it was in a GameStop post. Or I think it was an IGN post. <laughs> After years of speculation, Zelda's voice actor, Patricia Somerset. I did actually get to meet her at uh, Fan Expo one year. I think it was the same year that I got to see Jody Benson as Ariel. And Jody is going to come again this year, as well as the guy that plays Anakin Skywalker. Um... After years of speculation, Zelda's voice actor, along with a key location in Tears of the Kingdom, has hinted that Zelda and Link are actually in a relationship. Now... Oh. Oh, we can't go in here yet. You who set foot in this labyrinth of the sky. Go to the labyrinth of the land, deep within its corridors. A dragon ring sleeps, awaiting the one who will wake it. Okay, so we just have to go to the one below it. You know what? That's fair. We were going to go there anyways. Whoa. Yeah, we were going to go down here anyways.
This is the labyrinth. <laughs> we, we were here before. We were definitely here before. And uh, it took us quite a while to get around this place. So it seems like we're going to need to bring out some fires. So now, so now the problem is with this one is that uh, we don't have Rivali's Gale with us. So we're going to have to figure this out on our own. Oh, wait a minute. Is it down there? Oh, I did. Why did it have to break there? I didn't even hit it. Oh, maybe it could be there. Just. Uh, let's see. Do do. Come on. Yeah, there we go. Uh, do, 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 do. Get that out of the way. Oh, it's just a treasure. Oh, hey, treasure. Mighty Zonite Sword. All right, cool. Might as well have to climb ourselves back up there. Oh, hang on. There's stairs. Oh, no way. I actually did find it. <laughs> no way. I've actually managed to go through it. Research log. Day four. I guess I missed out on the three ver uh, previous days. I've done it. At long last, I've done it. I found a relic of the Zonai civilization, though my euphoria is short-lived. In the hours since my discovery, I've tried touching, hitting, and yelling at the relic, but it remains unresponsive. I'm starting to fear that I may not unravel the secrets of the Zonai after all. The thought makes me makes the cold even more bitter. Well, fine. I suppose it's time I crawl out of this frigid pit and issue my report on my investigation. Oh, it seems like someone did not have a good time. Oh, dear. Huh. That's a chasm. <laughs> oh, yeah. Do we actually want to try it? Do we actually want to go down a chasm? I'm actually kind of curious. I want to go down there. Oh. Oh, that's an opening. I was going to say, there's something else here. So, where... Oh, the the ring. Okay. That must be the ring that they were talking about. Just have to wait until this melts. I'm pretty sure it's going to give me a blessing afterwards. The Mayo Taki Shrine. Yep, sure enough, it's just going to give us a blessing. Yeah, I, I feel so bad for the Overwatch streamers, though, like... And we talked to a Blizzard dev about why the PvE was cancelled. Oh my god, diamond? Yo, we actually found a diamond. It has 25 fuse attack power, but it can be sold for a high price. We can actually duplicate it now. <laughs> I mean... I don't know if this is still patched out, but... We can finally get diamond now. Alright, cool. But yeah, I, I feel so bad about the Overwatch streamers now, like... With all this shit going on, and like... It wasn't really Aaron's fault, or like, the Overwatch team's fault... 
for doing this decision. It was it was actually Blizzard. It was actually Blizzard's idea about doing this. Yeah, I just realized too, wasn't Microsoft supposed to buy Blizzard too? Whatever happened to that deal? Yeah, look at that. For you who conquered this labyrinth of land, I, ruler of the owls, have unlocked the door. Find it on the west side of the labyrinth of the sky. Okay. So now that we have that unlocked... Ooh. Okay, so I guess this doesn't open yet. Oh god! Uh... Um, get me out of here. Oh my god. I did not see that coming. Freaking floor masters. Oh my god. Those are scary as fuck. I think I'm good. Oh my god. All right, now we can touch this. Oh my god, that scared me. I offer a test of wisdom. Okay. Four terminals are hidden in this maze. Activate them all. Oh god. <laughs> are, are you sure about this now? Are you sure we want to do this? I mean... I don't think we have any choice. At least there's wind. Four terminals, right? And uh, as long as there is zero gravity, we can do this just fine. So the question is, what kind of terminals do they look like? I think we might have to land somewhere. Okay, so as long as there's low gravity too, we don't get hurt from fall damage. Oh, I think we see one. Yeah, buddy. We found one. Let's go. This is such a cool looking labyrinth, though. Uh, not that way. You! God, I. I remember going through these kinds of mazes. Like, I still remember that one session I did where. I legit had me and Patrick do, like, one player, two controllers. Whoa. Yeah, it was like one player, two Joy-Cons, like, like that other thing. Oh, damn, okay. Okay, so you can get hurt. I think that's the one I already activated, yeah. So you can get hurt from fall damage. That's if you're, if you're falling, like, hard enough. Yeah, I remember doing stuff like this. I would remember doing a recording session in Breath of the Wild where it had like Patrick and Amanda in the background. And it was like the uh, two players, one controller. That was it. Like Patrick would control the left con uh, Joy-Con and I would hold the right. <laughs> it was kind of a it was kind of an okay experience like it wasn't I think it was that it wasn't too hard oh I see a treasure though mighty zonite sword um 
I'll take you. At least they're getting really good weapons here. Yeah, there's one. All right, we got two. Okay, so I guess three of them are going to be in the corners of the labyrinth. And then there's probably going to be one in the middle somewhere. Hey, yep. There we go. That is one here. So now I just have to figure out about the fourth one. Which is going to be the tricky part. Um, let's check the map. It could probably be like right dab in the middle somewhere. I just have to figure out which opening I have to take to get there. Holy moly, what? Okay, so I guess we found a draft somewhere that took us high enough to get to the top of the labyrinth. Um, and I take it that's where the shrine's gonna be located. Now we just have to figure out if this leads us... Okay, I see it. So I guess we just had to go to the top, right? Or did we have to go somewhere? Oh, I see. Okay. Probably from like a staircase somewhere. Ugh, there we go. We got it. We got the shrine. Actually, that's not even a shrine. Oh, hang on. Whew, there we go. We did it. We have conquered the labyrinth. You who have traversed this maze, mark well my words. I have pulled apart the bars in the labyrinth of the land that obstructed your path below ground. From high above to far below, prove your courage by diving into the depths of the earth. The final way shall open to you. We're gonna have to go down that chasm, aren't we? <laughs> no fucking way. We're gonna have to go in there? Oh god, okay. Um Pumpkin. Oh, we're actually gonna have to go down there, boys. Right into the cavern. I guess I think I can see it all the way to the bottom. Well, here we go. All the way to the bottom. Oh, this is <laughs> this is scary as fuck. Oh god. This is like the nether. Um, I might need to use, uh, one of these. Uh. 
Wait, oh my god, are you serious? You have got to be shitting me. There's a third labyrinth down here? Oh, and that's where the old maps take you? Down here? Oh my god. At least I have this, so I can mark the way. Oh my god. What are these? They're Poe's! Yo! You can find those here? A glowing spirit orb found all over the depths. Offer these to the Bargainer statue for a variety of awards. Yo, really? That's how you get Poe's? Oh shoot! Uh... Uh... Okay. Huh. You don't mean to tell me we have to fight this dude, right? Ugh. Um... Oh dear. Okay. If it's a fight you want, it's a f fight you'll get. Oh. Oh, I th I think I did pick that up. Okay. Oh, great. Now it's just a moving platform. Nice catch. All right. Nice catch there. All right, now it's a cube. Ugh. Okay, um, let's use this one. All right, turn into the robot. Do I need my, uh, do I need that defense up for this? Uh, or do I even have it? I have an attack up. I'm just pretty scared because, like, if any one of those things hit me... Yeah, like, if any of one of those hit me, then I think I'm dead. Oh, it changed back to the robot. Okay. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. That just takes so long to hit. All right, cube. Cube time.
Okay. Ooh. Oh my god. No, I missed it. Okay, I think one more cycle will do it. <sighs> this is scary as hell. Oh my god. did it <laughs> let's go let's go baby I did it I've managed to kill another one in the dark and got a large crystallized charge that is actually used to uh, that is used to build up your energy cells it equals to tw uh, 20 normal crystallized charges. Oh my god. That was our... F you know what? That was our first try, too. That was literally our first try, and I got it. It actually just shows how much we've grown from this game already. Like, how well trained we got. Oh my god. I can't believe we did it. I thought we were going to get lost in this labyrinth in the dark, but we found out there was a there was like a strong boss here and then we took it. I commend your achievements and offer a fitting reward. Armor wreathed in otherworldly evil, hidden away since days of old. Take it now. <laughs> oh, baby. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Oh, let's see what it is. I think it's a garment. That's just Ganon's outfit, isn't it? Evil spirit greaves. Some believe these greaves are inspirited by a malevolent, a malevolent entity. The, uh, their rather rare find. Yo. Yeah, no, that's literally Ganon's pants and shoes. Huh. No freaking way. I just got Ganon's pants. Holy shit. I have absolutely no idea where I am in this chasm. But I feel like we need to discover that from another spot. Oh my god, I, that is such amazing. I'm gonna have to warp back to... Was it this one or was it up in the sky? I'm, I'm gonna take the sky. Because I still need to get to the geoglyph. 